saw it in that uh, beta function form right here. So beta B cube, that's the equation six four two zero to pi over two sine two P minus one because sine theta two Q minus one D theta. Now, of course, we can modify the top one to say zero pi over two uh, sine theta to the minus half. D theta. And uh, mix and match now. Yeah. Uh, if you mix and match. Now, obviously, the cosine is missing. All that means is this is zero. Because if that's zero, it gets you a one. Right. Minus one equals zero, which makes Q a half. Already? And uh, the two oh, p minus right. one, one, yeah, they're both exponents. Uh, and the two p minus one is minus half. And so we will get p equals uh, one fourth. Okay, good. And uh, uh, now you have your p and q. You could go into equation seven one, uh, and you know that is equal to gamma function of p, gamma function of q, over gamma function of p plus q. Right. So we know that P is uh, one fourth. P is one fourth and Q is half. So then uh, P of one half gamma one fourth will equal gamma one fourth times gamma of one half all over gamma of one half plus one. Okay. Do you have a question? Yeah, and then we can use the iteration formulas or the recursion formulas to simplify that. Uh, we know that gamma one half, I believe, was part. Yeah. This is equation five three. Right. And we know that gamma of P plus one is equal to P gamma of P. This is equation three. So um uh, so gamma of three fourths. That's the same thing of gamma of one plus uh, one minus one fourth. So minus one fourth plus one will get you three fourths. And this is just equal to uh, minus one for gamma of minus one fourth, which we already discussed on how to get gammas of negative numbers, yeah. Uh,
or you could use the definition of the gamma function to do that, but it's, it's just an integral, it's longer. So it's probably better to leave it as, um, better to leave it as, uh, uh, to, to, do, to do it with the recursion formulas and so on. Or we could leave it, we could leave the answer as a gap because they say leave your answer. Uh, yeah, because it seems to me we're not going to be able to evaluate uh, gamma one fourth and gamma three fourths. Yeah, so. Uh, so, uh, so that means here, yeah, let's just get rid of this. And that means our final answer for this would be, uh, one half of that because there was one half in front of the integral. So then our final answer would be integral from zero to pi over two. What, do you have a question, Matt? Oh, I got, I got this thing. Yeah, uh, you could, uh, I don't think we're gonna be able to simplify Leave the answer in front of that. Let me see here. In what format is that? Yeah, it's fine. Uh, Let's leave it like that one too. Uh, yeah, that's fine. So this is going to be because remember there was a two. So, uh, and then over gamma. It would be this is like how to evaluate. 